He's so amazing. My nigga trying to show you how I live. I ain't playing. I'm just saying, girl, you know just what it is. Get your girl in the whip and she. Consistent Zayn of building. Famously amazing in the building. Year was Gucci, everybody. It's your boy, Famously Amazing. I'm back with another video. Yes, I am in the bathroom. No, I'm not sitting on the toilet. I'm sitting on the bucket right now. Um. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys smash that like, I mean, smash that subscribe button. If you guys are already a subscriber, make sure you guys smash that um, like button. So I put a post on Facebook today. It was basically like, women give some men some relationship advice. A lot of people commented below some relationship advice. So we're about to go straight through these comments, see what y'all say, and see what kind of advice y'all got to give to us. All right? Simple, easy peasies as lemon squeezed D's. Um, let's get straight to it. You feel me, though? All right. So first up, we got Alexis. She says every female isn't the same. First off, second, we know y'all got soft ass hearts. Stop trying to be all tough. I agree. Um, me personally, I'm not the old old tough guy. Try that all right, tough guy, whatever shit. But I know exactly what you're talking about. Um, yeah, I don't know why guys try to put on that whole persona like they're mean or or they just want to be like all tough and shit whatever like for what like what's the point i don't get it like i don't know like especially like when guy when girls come around certain guys they want to oh, say they like around them guy they want to like talk down on the other guy to make themselves look better or some shit like that which i don't understand like i honestly don't get that or they like want to fight or some shit like for what like for who are you trying you really trying to Prove you can fight. Okay, we okay. Okay, we don't. Okay, what? What's your, what's your, what's your, what's your reason? <sighs> Moving on, we got Melody. She says, "Communicate. Stop looking for something more than what you all got." Facts. I agree with that one too. Um, communication is a very important part of a relationship. Um, stop looking for more than what you got. Yeah. Next up, we got Julia. She says, stop doing too much in the beginning, then doing nothing once you're settled. We fall in love with the way you are. Then once you stop going out your way to start going out your way for stuff, we start feeling not appreciated. Yep. That's actually um, how I fucked up in my old relationship, my last relationship. I actually stopped doing the things that... Um, I did to get her. I basically, it's like I stopped caring for her, um, and that played a big part of my breakup. Guys, you y'all need to honestly like everything you're doing to get your girl. Continue to do that when you have her, so she can feel appreciated. You know, once you stop writing her every day, stop telling you love her, stop telling her she's beautiful, stop telling her this, stop telling her that, stop going out with her, blah blah. Once you stop all that, then. You know, a, a woman needs to feel appreciated every day. They probably don't mean, they probably don't say it. You probably don't know, but they do. They want to feel appreciated one day, every day. They want to feel wanted. They want to feel loved. You know. But I actually know this quote that says, and this comes from Billy D. Williams. He said, "Your girl, your woman is like a flower in a garden. If you love her and cherish her." She'll return that love with the full glory of her blossoming of her beauty. With the full glory of the blossoming of her beauty. But if you choke her with that weed called pride and selfish and hate, all your love and her love will wither and die. Now, that probably went over some of y'all heads. Basically, cherish your girl, love your girl. If you don't, it's going gonna, it's gonna to die. It's going gonna, it's gonna to not be there anymore. Think on that. Moving on, we got Tiara. She says, listen to her. Communication is key, but comprehension is everything. Yes. Y'all both have to compromise during the situation. Guys and girls. It's not just for guys, it's for girls too. Y'all both have to, have to compromise. It's a 50 50, 100 100 thing. You know, y'all both in there together. Y'all have to work as a team. You know, y'all both have to do this no matter if, oh, this, oh, she don't like, um, she don't like, me uh, with all my football stuff or he say oh I don't she uh, he don't like me or all this pink stuff I don't y'all both have to compromise you know communication is a very important thing in a relationship next we got Vanessa she says answer every question when we ask multiple questions not just the last one well first of all 
<laughs> y'all got it. Y'all ask a lot of questions. Y'all really be trying to get to the bottom of some shit, which is which is cool. There's nothing wrong with that. There's there's nothing honestly wrong with that. That's what y'all need to do. You know, if something a situation happened, y'all need to ask as much questions as possible because niggas do be lying. Um, and guys, yes. Answer every question. If y'all know y'all right and y'all girl just assuming some shit, answer every question. T and, and stick to it. And if you lying, I don't know what to tell you, bro. These girls, they, they'll, 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 like Medea said, they will ask one question one month and then ask you that same question some more months to see if they got that same answer. These y'all females are slick. Y'all think y'all know some shit, but I know some shit. You know what I know. <sighs> Moving on. Tiffany says, stop getting all frustrated when we don't know what to eat. We completely know, but y'all would be y'all be more frustrated with the truth. The nuggets from Chick-fil-A, fries from McDonald's, onion rings from Hooters, the spinach dip from TGI Fridays, a frosty from Wendy's, and a single from Taco Bell. Just pick. Woo! This girl ain't playing. Your hungry ass. That shit all sound good though. But nah, um, it's not that we get annoyed that y'all don't want to eat. I mean, don't don't know what y'all want to eat. It's just that most of the time, us guys eat everything. So it's like we're not picky. So it's like whatever you choose, we will be, we will be okay with that. Well, well, I'm speaking for me for that. Whatever y'all choose, I'll be okay. I literally eat anything. So when I if I was to ask what you want to eat, and they'll be like, oh, it's up to you. Don't say it's up to me because y'all females are the picky eaters. Our guy, us guys, we will eat anything. We'll eat your ass. You think we're gonna be picky about some food? No. So, when we ask y'all what y'all want to eat, just let us know. But guys, don't get mad. That's your girl. You know, just try to hold it in as much as possible. You feel me? Next, we got Jennifer Stain. She says, it's okay to open up. I know today's society, men feel like they have to be tough all the time. Your mental health is important. Talk to her. Don't be afraid. She's, going to, she's not going to judge you. Wait, don't be afraid that she's not going to. Don't be afraid that she's going to judge you. If she loves you, then she's going to help you understand and not belittle, belittle you. Yes, that's your girl. If you can't talk, that's the per, that's supposed to be the person you're supposed to talk to. That's the, supposed to be the one that you tell all your feelings to, problems to. That's supposed to be your significant other. Why wouldn't you want to tell your problems to that person? And when you don't, that's when y'all get old, hotness, you should have told me, blah, blah, when the person don't know. Um, yeah, talk to your girl, man. Uh, don't go back and tell your boys, because your boys always got something, going to have to say something about your girl that you probably would not want to hear and it's going to start a big ass argument whatever so tell your girl communicate like i said communication is key talk to her you don't need to be afraid to open up to your girl shit you don't need to be afraid to cry in front of your girl that's your girl she need, if you want to spend the rest of your life with her then you honestly have to show her that like you have to give it your all don't be afraid of nothing <sighs> video man long as it's been. um next up we got nicole she says don't ever be afraid to express your feelings or emotions Mental health is extremely important. If something is bothering you, speak up. This go with communication. Yes, I basically just said that. Um, yeah, don't be afraid. Next, we got Naira. She says, yep, what they said. Next, we got Samantha. She says, learn their love language as well as yours. Facts. Yes, like, <clears throat> get to know. Are you talking about sex? You talking about sex? Yo, you freaky. Oh, you fr yo, freaky. No. It's like, no. Nah. But, um. Yeah, know, know that love language. Y'all honestly need to know that, fellas. Uh, know what your girl like, know what she dislike. Yeah, that's another big, important thing in a relationship. All right, last we got Brittany. She says, it's okay to show emotion and express yourself. Women hate the guessing game. And if you're not feeling her, just say that shit. Don't stop talking to her and have her guessing. First session is free. Yes, fellas. Um... Don't waste her time. Nowadays, girls don't want their time wasted. Most girls don't want their time wasted. If a girl just wants sex, she's going to tell you. But if she don't and honestly wants something, and if you just want that, just let it be known from the jump. If you're not feeling her, tell her you're not feeling her. If you just want something, tell her you just want something. If you honestly want to build a relationship with her, build a relationship with her. Don't just play, don't just sit there and play games with her because, you know, these females are not really with that. And I'm sure most of these females have been through some stuff. And for you to just bring her right back into doing the same shit that the ne previous nigga did, that's going to make it worse. So... I just gotta say, yeah, man, just be straight up, straightforward, and you Gucci. Um, this video's getting long. That's basically it from everybody. I appreciate y'all Appreciate y'all for all commenting. Um, we want to roll to 1K, 1K. Make sure all you guys smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. Um, make sure y'all comment below what are some advice tips. Uh, I'm going to do a guy one next. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love y'all. He's so amazing. My nigga.
nigga trying to show you how I live. I ain't playing, I'm just saying, girl, you know just what it is. Got your girl in the whip and she bumping to my